Discover the fascinating story of Alexandra Cobinel and the significance of Napoleon III's purchase of one of his masterpieces. In 1863, France was under the rule of Napoleon III, an emperor passionate about art and a great supporter of artists. The Paris Salon was the most prestigious art exhibition of the time, showcasing talents of both French and international artists. Cobinel was a French academic painter known for his historical and mythological works, and he was a regular participant at the Paris Salon. In 1863, Cobinel completed his masterpiece The Birth of Venus, a painting inspired by the myth of Venus, the goddess of love and beauty. That year, Cobinel presented The Birth of Venus at the Salon, where it caught the attention of critics and visitors alike. The Birth of Venus is famous for its idealized depiction of the female figure, the use of delicate colors and gradations to create an ethereal and sensual atmosphere. Napoleon was captivated by Cobinel's work and decided to purchase it for his personal collection. The purchase of a piece of art directly from the emperor was a highly prestigious recognition for an artist. Thanks to Napoleon's purchase, Cobinel's fame grew internationally, solidifying his reputation as one of the leading artists of the era. The acquisition of the birth of Venus by Napoleon demonstrated the value of academic art and reinforced its position in the society of the time. The painting influenced many subsequent artists, who drew inspiration from Cobinel's style and technique in depicting the female figure. Cobinel became a central figure in French art, teaching at the École des Beaux-Arts in Paris and shaping the next generation of artists. Even after his death in 1889, Alexandre Cobinel remains one of the most important French academic painters. The anecdote of Napoleon III and the birth of Venus highlights the importance of support and recognition in the art world and how a single gesture can have a lasting impact on an artist's career and legacy. Alexandre Cobinel is an example of how talent, passion, and the right recognition can create an artistic icon still celebrated and admired today.